Bob, I'll let uh, Larry or somebody else uh, say something. We'll catch you later. KD9, stay at Roger, Roger. 73, Ron. Come on back when you have more time to play ham radio with your buddy. And Larry, my yard must be saturated because I cannot seem to keep that SWR below 1.4. What the hell? Where's that coming from, I wonder? Well, we had a great big monster something. I mean, if you look at the, uh, the, the weather thing, we had a great big something come through here earlier today. My gosh, it almost blew my house away. What? <laughs> Yeah, I, I thought we were having a tornado, but, but Bill said that they were uh, talking about tornado warnings and stuff like that, so yeah. Yeah, they did. I, I looked at uh, all the weather uh, systems out there, and they were predicting uh, tornadic weather all the way from Cary down to Republic and over by you. It was a pretty, pretty big system. The same system was here last night. But there is something brewing in your neighborhood right now, is that correct? No, nothing here. So where is it? Is it somewhere up there? Right over by you? No, the one by me, uh, that already went by. It's like in over Pennsylvania right now, but... Let me look. I could have sworn I saw a cluster or something in your neighborhood. Let me look. Dry as a bone over here. Everything is over you guys. Hey, Terry Bob. Oh, uh, yes, sir. Yeah, I turned my amplifier off because uh, I was listening on two meters. And my, I was getting RF and it was shooting my two meter radio uh, all which way. Well, you sound really good with no amplifier. couldn't tell whether you were amplificated or not. And oh, Larry, that thing is coming out of Cheyenne into Nebraska and it's moving into Sioux Falls. So yes, it's nowhere close to you, but it's rain and snow and sleet and all of that over there. Oh yeah, I see it now. Yeah, it's, it's, it's mostly rain though. Yeah. It's got a little piece of snow on the western edge of it. Hey, Larry, which way you got the monster pointed? Uh, 145 degrees from here, so that puts me into North Florida. Oh, you're coming right through me then. Yeah, I would say. Yeah, I got your 30 over over here. Oh, I guess that's good. Yeah, the monster's working just fine. Hey, uh, Larry, you see that bow? That the, the one that came through here has got with it. It's got a bow to it. I do. Yeah, that was a big, strong wind, my friend. I wonder if there's any tornadoes that actually touch down in the middle of that. It looks because there was a lot of them over here. I don't know, I'm not sure. Well, so if Terry Bob doesn't give me a whooping, I'm going to go take a break and get me an apple. I will be listening as I eat the apple away. Whiskey, sugar, eight, November. <laughs> All right, my friend, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. That's right. Come on, Doctor. Doctor. And I think I heard the answer John the answer. What's going on with your throat, Tim?
Okay, Whiskey 9, Sierra Kilo Delta. Okay, very good. My name is Tim. Tango, India Mike, and I'm located in Central Michigan, and you're about the 5 and 9 with me, but there are some static crashes.
got to remember, Terry Bob, every day we live or every second we live, that's closer to death, right? Well, I'm agreeing with you, but, you know, if you're not growing, you're dying.